Today I'm going to talk about marketing at work. Marketing requires you to be innovative, to make your art public, for you to find clients that will buy your art. Now there are various factors to consider when marketing at work. One, you need to know your art. Two, you need to know your clients. Three, you need to know how to prize your work. Four, you need to know how to present your work. Five, you need to know how to package your work to reach the people. Six, you need to advertise your work. Okay, that is promotion. For you to advertise, you need to know social media platforms. You need to use one-on-one -on -one discussions with people. And you need to use printed posters that can be put around. Now, knowing your art. You're the artist. You know your area of specialization. And so maybe you're good at landscapes or sunsets or still life drawings or portrait drawings. So it's good to know your art. Now, presenting your art is very important. Know your clients. You realize that your target market will help you sell your art to the best price or to a very low price. So it's important that you frame your art or present it in a way that it will really make the clients admire your work and that will lead us to pricing pricing is a very detailed aspect of marketing if your art is too pricey then it may not find the right clientele and if your art is too low in price then people may think it's not the best of a piece so you need to really check your clients if your clients are the people who can buy then market it in a way, present it in a way that it will enhance the piece and make them look at it with an eye to buy. Now, how do you present your work? Of course, through an exhibition. And people will see it and will want it. Okay? Now, if someone wants your work and have decided they're going to buy it or rather they've deposited something or they've even paid for it, how do you package it? If it's a 3D piece, it's important to package it in a box and um, maybe write fragile to ensure that it's safely delivered. If it's a 2D piece, maybe it's a glass framed piece. You need to also write fragile on top, uh, this side up, so that um, and it's supported by with cardboards so that it's very uh, well cushioned for delivery or for transportation. Now, when you're promoting your art, you need to advertise it definitely because if you do art and you don't promote it, then you cannot get the right clients. So it's very important that you use one, social media, and this is network marketing that will reach many people. And um, for this, I would um, advise that you reach out to the people you know, reach out to groups of people, uh, write emails to people, invite people maybe to an exhibition, or just throw a poster Okay, a social media poster to people and they'll see your art and they'll want to come for it. Of course, printing posters and putting them around your target market is important. You can put your work on billboards if you can afford. But just put posters around on trees and posters everywhere around. It will be important for people to see your art. Now, one-on-one -on -one discussions are very important. When you meet people, talk about it. For example, if it's on a parents' day meeting, if it's on a... Um, a sports day meeting, if it's on an annual prize giving day, it's important that you stand by your art in an exhibition 